kids and welcome back. Today I want to journey with you to the farm as we paint a super cute farm animal. Now this farm animal is yellow. It's got a little beak and it goes tweet tweet. That's right, we're going to paint a little chick. So come with me as we paint a chick. Okay kids, for our little chick drawing and painting, you'll need a black felt tip or a pencil. You can have some paint brushes, some A4 paper, your chosen paints. Now I'm going to use a primary colour so I can mix my own and a white and a black. Some water and some kitchen roll. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we want to do is to draw our little chick. So the first thing we're going to draw is the beautiful round head. So if you'd like to follow me, let's draw the head. We're going to curve it all the way up to the top and all the way back down. Like so perfect. And then we're going to join these two together. It's not a perfect circle. It's more like a, a flat bottom circle. <laughs> okay, now we've got a beautiful head. Let's now draw the body. So for the body, Let's do a curve at either side, like this. And now let's add the feet. So for the feet, we're going to do two nice circles that then come up and join the body. So one circle there and one circle there, like that. Now let's join these two together with a nice little curve. Perfect, it's starting to come to life now. Now let's give our chick some little hands so we can draw two nice curves. There we go, it's got his little chick wings. Now for the nose, let's do a upward curve and a curve on the top too, like that. And let's draw in now let's draw in some eyes so let's do two circles either side of his little beak one circle there and one circle there perfect okay we've got a good base to start painting on now so this is going to be our beautiful little chick now let's bring our chick to life okay so to paint our chick i'm going to use yellow paint and mix some white paint into it to make it a little bit lighter and I'm going to paint my chick yellow I'm going to paint the head yellow and the body yellow so come on let's paint now you can do any color chick you like you could do a rainbow chick if you like you could do a blue chick you could do any color chick you like okay let's paint Perfect. Well done, everybody. Maybe a rainbow chick would look really cool. I wonder if anyone's doing a rainbow chick. Big lump of paint there. I'm going to spread that around. Don't worry if you paint over your ink. We can always go over it with our black paint or with our black felt tip once the paint has dried. Nearly there everyone, well done. Starting to look more like a chick now. Cute. Okay, 
Now when you've painted your chick, it's time to wash our brush. So for the next colour, I'm going to mix an orange for the feet and the beak. To mix an orange, I'm going to use my yellow and add some red. Look, that's a beautiful orange. And we mixed it all by ourselves, so it's our orange. Okay, let's paint in the feet. Lovely. And don't forget that little beak. Perfect, the chick's really coming to life now. <laughs> well done, everyone. I'm also going to give the chick some rosy cheeks. For rosy cheeks, I'm going to take some red paint and a little bit of white and make a pink. Perfect, it's a little bit more white, maybe a bit more white. There we go, that's a nice pink, I like that pink. Perfect. So using our pink, we can now do some nice rosy cheeks. Just underneath the eye, like that. Well done everyone. Now I'm going to paint the eyes black. For this, I'm going to use a smaller brush and my black paint. Get them eyes nicely painted in. This is when our chick really starts coming to life. Lovely, well done everybody. Well done, we've painted our chick. Now let's paint the background. You can paint the background any colour you like. I'm going to paint mine purple. For purple, I'm going to take some blue and some red and mix it together. Lovely, see? That's turning a beautiful purple. Now this purple is very dark, so I want it to be a lot lighter. To make it lighter, I'm going to add some white paint and give that a mix. Maybe you might want to do a rainbow background, or maybe you might want to do a green background. I'm going to keep mixing some white in because I want that a little bit lighter. Perfect, that's lovely. Okay. Okay, now it's time to paint the background. For the background, I'm using a big brush. I've mixed my violet, which I'm really excited to use. So here we go, let's get going. This is a fun bit where we can get really, really messy. I'm gonna get it all over the table, but that's fine. I don't mind, I like making a mess. You can always clean the mess up after. Art's about having fun, so let's have fun whilst we do this. Okay. Oh, I might run out of colour as well. Oh, it's okay. If we run out of colour, we can always mix another. Okay. Oh, it's going to be really hard to not paint the little chick. But we can do this. We've got this. We're going to need to be really patient. Ooh. See, even adults get scared. Okay, perfect. What's that? You're not scared. How are you not scared to get paint on your beautiful chick? Here we go. Lovely. Okay, I've run out of paint. But that's fine. Because I'm going to mix some more. So I'm going to take some more blue and red. And a lot more white. Okay, let's give that a mix. So this is going to be fun because now I'll have two different purples, I think. I don't think it will look the same as the purple I've already put down. But that's okay. I'm fine with that. Okay, let's go. Oh, it doesn't look too bad. Yay. <laughs> look at all the paint I'm getting on the table. I'd rather have fun and be messy than be really tidy and try and keep on the page. I can wipe it up later, that's fine. Let's get this. We're going around the chick now. This is a hard bit, everyone, but we can do it. Okay. Here goes nothing. You might want to make silly noises like me when you do it. That's fine. Ah, 
Okay, we're not doing too bad. Well done. How's it going on your end? Okay, we're doing well. Let's keep painting around the chick. We can always paint the black back on, but we don't want to get any purple inside on the yellow because that's going to be very hard to cover up. If we do, then we can turn it into something else. We'll make it into an opportunity. Okay. Woo! <laughs> I'm going to make lots of noises because I'm scared. Someone hold my hand, please. Oh, wait, I can't. I'm painting. Okay, never mind. Okay, cool. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my gosh, we've nearly done it, guys. We've nearly done it. We did it. Okay. We did it. Oh. Oh, we did it. Well done, everyone. We painted the chick. We painted the background. We didn't paint inside. Oh, look, I missed a bit. Well, that's okay. We can always touch it up. That's fine. Okay, Jenny, stop messing because you're going to get purple everywhere. So that's it. That's the chick on a purple background. I hope you really enjoyed this video and I hope you painted along. Let me know if you have in the comments. And if you can, you can always send me your beautiful artwork. Okay, I'll see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.